Yo, as a fool, Moshe de Ecosia, a US man penny, and a Ghana president, Nana, Dunka, a Kufu Ado, and no Moshe with Jubilee Housey. Now, question Marco by about gay, say Ghana, beg gay, a two mana. Now, when he say Ghana, so epe bussing or I am a phone. Tis an another cassa de via, loon, or Monsanka, the US for the time me. Time we pa said they will come to Ghana first because Ghana in Yabusia. What am I say? Ghana in Yabusia. She said, Nanado, I'm pinion the same young cat, Lunu, Emma. It's a guy no Ibsa question, you know, and Anasi, any US president, vice president, he kind of answer no, gay no, but in see gay no means we, and Anana, any day, a tattoo. It's a woman, she said, you see, call Sex intercourse, gay <laughs> sex remains a crime in Tanzania, <laughs> and same-sex relationships are outla outlawed in Zambia. What have you said to the president and plan to say to other leaders on this trip about the crackdown on human rights? And for the president as well, uh, you've talked about the proliferation of terrorist groups across the region, uh, as well as pirate activities along the western African coast. What does the presence of what does the presence of the Wagner Group uh, say about past U.S. support when it comes to security? What more do you need from the United States to combat this threat? And also, can you confirm that Al Qaeda has a presence currently in Ghana? Thank you. I'll start. Uh, I have raised this issue, and let me be clear about where we stand. First of all, for the American press who are here, you know that a great deal of, of work in my career has been to address human rights issues, equality issues across the board, including as it relates to the LGBT community. And I feel very strongly about the importance of supporting uh, the, the, the freedom and, and supporting and fighting for equality among all people and that all people be treated equally. I will also say that uh, this is an issue that we consider and I consider to be a human rights issue, and that will not change. Um, yes, what's the name? Sorry, Zolan Kano Young, said the New York Times. Z Zolan? Zolan Kano Young. Said, Mr. Young, so thank you for the question. First of all, we don't have any such legislation here in Ghana. A bill has been proposed to the Parliament of Ghana, which has all kinds of ramifications, which is now being considered by the Parliament. It hasn't been passed. So the statement that there is legislation in Ghana to that effect is not accurate. The bill is going through the parliament. It's going through the parliament. The attorney general has found it necessary to speak to the committee about it regarding the constitutionality or otherwise of several of its provisions, and the parliament is dealing with it. At the end of the process, I will come in. But in the, in the meantime, the parliament is dealing with it. And I have no doubt that the parliament of Ghana will show, as it has done in the past, one, first of all, its sensitivity to human rights issues, as well as to the feelings of our population, and will come out with a responsible response to the, to, to the proposed. The legislation was a legislation that has been provided provi as a private member's bill. This is not an official legislation of the government, but it is one that has been uh, been mooted by a handful of private members. So we will see what the final outcome of it. But I'm, uh, my understanding from the recent of the committee, the substantial elements of the bill have already been modified as a result of the intervention of the Attorney General. We will see what the final outcome will be. And that is the stage at which I will also have the opportunity to prevent. As far as the presence of, of Wagner is concerned, we are concerned about it. We made it clear our concerns um, because, first of all, it, it, it raises the very real possibility, which is one that we need all of us in the, on the region and the continent to be aware of, that once again our continent is going to become the playground for great power conflict. Because one group of people coming, whether they are an official or an unofficial group, all of us know the realities of what's going on. It's not very difficult for another group of people to say, there, there, we will come. And before you know it, the, the, the issues of, of concern to us, keeping our country is, and the of great power rivalry will be a reality with us. So that's our major preoccupation. 
Yes, and, and but in any event, also we want to be in a position to resolve our own security problems ourselves, if as much as possible, without the intervention of foreign troops. The presence of Al Qaeda in Ghana, I don't know. I of, of formally we don't have any uh, information to that effect. I may well be that there are cells, etc., already in the country, but those are matters that the security agencies are very much on top of. And we are hoping that there will be no Al Qaeda presence in Ghana.